Hey everybody, it's me, Glitter Mama, and today is a beauty favorite video for the summer. I know I said that ass backwards. A summer beauty favorites, and that is beauty products and makeup products. So, you better hold on to your seats because it's gonna be a long ass ride because I got a lot of beauty and a lot of makeup products for you for this video. So I hope that you like this video because yeah and don't forget to subscribe to me and also don't forget to follow me on all of my you know my, my stuff like snapchat and twitter and instagram because you can catch up with me on a daily basis that way and see what i do on a daily because that's who i am so let's start off with sugar scrubs sugar scrubs are Arth is something that I have incorporated this year that I have never really thought about using until this year. And the reason being is because I was for two weeks peeling like a big bitch and I scrubbed it off and literally uh, it, it saved, it, it's, it's Captain Save All basically. It saved the fucking day. Okay. And the one that I got is from this brand, Tree Hut. I've never heard of it before. Um, I just got it at my local grocery store. And this is the Shea Sugar Scrub. And this is in the scent Hawaii Kukui. I don't know if I'm saying that right. But it just looks like this. Literally, it looks like applesauce. <laughs> but it smells so good. And I only use this like once a week just to kind of exfoliate my skin i think it's really good for you to exfoliate exfoliate your skin on a on a weekly basis at least so you can get all the dead skin off of you and then on top of everything else this shit makes your skin so smooth and soft and amazing even though my skin i guess because i have an oilier skin uh combinate skin type um it usually stays a really good moisturize good and moisture you know what I'm talking about. You know, I don't have a lot of issues as far as that is concerned. It's just my face and my hair that I actually have a lot of concern about. So, yeah. So, the next thing is something that I have been using since I can remember. Like, my mom has been using it. I use it. I think I've been using it since the beginning of my tanning days, which has been probably, like, late middle school. Late, uh, late elementary school. <laughs> Um, and this is the Hawaiian Tropic Dark Tanning Oil. This shit is the bomb. I'm telling you, girl, like, if you want a good tanning oil, even though it's a cheap drugstore tanning oil, this is the way to go. I mean, I'm pretty sure all the other tanning oils are great out there, but this one smells really good, too, and it reminds me of my, my younger, like, it reminds me of spring break, or summer breaks while I was a kid, basically. Yeah, me and my mom would sit out in the sun for, like, hours and getting, like, tan the fuck up, basically. Like, super dark. Like, we would have competitions about who is darker. And so, like, she would try to start early, but then I would beat her to the punch one year, and then I would do it. And I would try to do it, like, every single day and, like, stay out for, like, four or five hours. It was crazy. Let me just put it that way. It was fucking crazy. But now, I don't have to. I can just be lazy and not have to be in the sun a lot and then I can use these LA um summer LA tan sunless mousse these things are so like these get you so fucking dark and it's streakless and it's dark and it smells good on top of everything else and I'm telling you like these are at Walmart for like 10 bucks a piece and you can get little travel size ones for like if you're traveling and you're not going to have like your full seven ounce bottle with you, you can travel with like a smaller one. So I recommend you to go get this because this is the bomb.com. Like I'm telling you, like sunless tan there's are the way to go, are the way to go, are the way to go. Best believe it. And somehow I've got some random ass hair sticking like crazy. Okay, so the next thing I want to talk about is body shimmer. Yes, shimmer from anywhere, Bath and Body Works, um, Victoria's Secret, Walmart, 
dollar stores, whatever. I got mine from the dollar store. This is Mango Passion and you can spray this shit all over you and it's not an overpowering spray or anything like that. So if you want to lather yourself in this shit, let me just show you the shimmer on this and let me just put it this way. I fell asleep one night without taking a shower and I woke up and I still had this shit on. It's not going to come off. Let me just put it that way. Um, it might come off a little bit, but not too much. So, and it's not going to get all over you or anything like that. It's great for the pool or the beach if you're wanting to get some sparkles going on. And I'm glitter mama. I'm down for anything like that. Let me just tell you, girl, I am down for anything. Okay. Okay. So, I'm going to tell you my favorite color for the summer. And it's what I'm wearing right now. And it says bright it's supposed to be pink and this is from the l'oreal um collection or collection exclusive and it's like where they like team up with like celebrities and then they pick out like their favorite pink their favorite nude their favorite red and i got this one because it is a bright ass pink it's laya i don't know who laya is look at this girl and this is the color right there. I mean, you can look at my lips and it's fucking pretty as fuck. You know what I mean? Like, come on, girl. Like, who wouldn't want a bright fucking pink for the summertime? Like, I do. Like, pink's my color. Pink's my jam. Let's get it going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay. And then, obviously, I got a peach color because peach is in this, this summer. And this is the color, this color right here next to it is the color i don't know if you can see it or not it's amazing i this um is from l'oreal as well but any kind of peach color i'm telling you girl so pretty so adorable and then of course we gotta go with nude and this is another one from the uh, collection but this is j-lo's and this is it right there um, so pretty and I actually buy nudes like it's going out of style I buy nudes because I wear nudes all year long I just tend to get darker and I tend to get lighter in the fall in this in the fall of winter and summer in the spring and all them fun stuff and then of course we got to go with classic red because who doesn't like classic red your girl does um i used to never like red until i said damn that looks good on me like hello so it's growing on me more than you'll think oh my god i just burped at the same time so this is the duo um ombre lip duo from nyx and this is the dark color it's like a wine color it is very matte and it stays on like it's going outside like this would be perfect for like in the fall when you're doing a lot more of the darker lips or you're doing more of a you know what i'm saying like you we do a lot more darker lips during the fall and the winter time and then here is this bright ass red i think this is a classic red like look at that girl i'm telling you and i mean this is perfect for all year like everybody's needs a classic red like i use red a lot during christmas time um last year i know i did a few times and i also use it in the summertime when i'm ready to do some sort of classic look yeah classic look so yeah okay so now we're gonna go to face because i feel like that is probably appropriate to do now i don't know why I'm just doing it all out of whack so this is a oil free primer from a cover girl and i am an og cover girl user like anything that comes from cover girl i had been loving until recently just because i've been like expanding and broadening my horizon when it comes to brands and makeup i've been kind of like the the guinea pig of makeup right now um and this is oil free Oh, did I say that? But it's very important for me because I'm an oilier person and, you know, why not? And it's cheap as fuck. Like, cheap as fuck. And I've had it for, like, two or three months now. And I only, a little goes a long way and I still have plenty in that shit. Let me just put it that way. And then, of course, this 
um, Fit Me from Maybelline. It's the Matte Plus Poreless. This is very excellent for anybody who is oily, especially in the winter time, when, or winter time, in the summertime, when you do sweat like a grown ass man. Ugh, I know I do. It's disgusting. And then, of course, I have the matching um, Fit Me. I also have one in the um, Set Plus Smooth if you're a dewier one, which I like that like dewier look when I'm like home by myself and I'm not going out in the hot sun too much um, and I'm just filming for you guys, um, then I will use that. So if you ever see me with like a really pretty glow and it's like all over glow, then you know why. And then also to go along with it is this. And I'm telling you, Jeffree Star, the queen, he told me to get this, so I had to get it. So if he told you to get something, you get it, okay? Don't just be like, whatever, Jeffree. Like, I ain't gonna get that shit. Get it, get it. It is the Pro Glow Infallible from L'Oreal if you're interested in it. And I got the tan one, so, so yeah, so yeah, so yeah, yeah. And then next, we got to talk about highlighters, highlights. This highlight from the um, Contour Master Contour Kit um, set is, oh my god, girl. This is the light one. Look at that. Isn't that to die for? Like, I don't know where I'm going to put it, though. Let me just swatch it over here. And I'm obsessed with like going crazy. Look at this highlight. Ugh. It's it's just pathetic. And then I have another one in another contour, same contour palette. But it is so gorgeous. This is for like anybody who has a darker complexion. Like I just want to show you like my arms are freaking dark. But look at that. It is so pretty like... <sighs> I mix match them a lot like I'll just like put whatever highlighter I feel like on it on all these spots and I'm like damn and like my brother thought I had like something white on them like that's my highlighter bitch don't fucking wipe it off you wipe it off and I'm gonna kick your ass I'm gonna kick your ass best believe I will kick your ass okay so this is like my everything palette for the summertime i've been rocking more of a neutral nudey kind of colors which in my eyes it's like nudes and pinks and like right now i've got like a pinky kind of light pink color but look isn't that pretty this is the la palette let me just show you it's the la palette from l'oreal and it's the number one one number one nude number one or whatever and there's a few matte colors in here but there is so many shimmers and i'm glad i'm on it and i have to have shimmer but the color that i used kind of on my base of my eyes eyelid i guess it is is this color right here it's gorge as fuck let me just put it that way and i haven't used all of these colors yet but eventually I will. You best believe it. Um, and also, there's a few colors in there that I use for, like, my eyebrows and things like that. So, yeah. I mean, come on. Like, it's amazing. Also, lately I've been wearing eyeliner all on top of my lids. And, and I've been wearing eyeliner on the bottom, like, in my waterline. But I've been wearing this lately just because I've been wearing my lashes, which I'll show you here in a second. Um, and this is the Master Duo uh, from Maybelline. Um, at first I was like, oh, I don't think I like this shit. But as soon as I put it on, I've been so obsessed with it. It's so black. Like, everybody says that the Perversion eyeliner from Urban Decay is pretty dark. So I'm going to have to go get that because I, the black, the better. The blacker, the better. Like, that's how I feel with eyeliners but this is pretty dark compared to the eyeliner that I had been using but I have that one as like a little travel guy anyway and it goes in my touch-up bag speaking of touch-up bag let me just show you this because it's gorgeous this is the um my favorite cosmetic bag for the summer so far I've seen the July one like I have a sneak peek of it and I'm like I'm not feeling it right now so I'm gonna stick with the June ipsy bag for right now because you know 
it's cute. Now let's talk about lashes because why not? I have been super obsessed with wearing lashes lately, like all the time. Like I used to just be like just my own lashes because I was a retard and I didn't know how to fucking put them on right. Well, I, I couldn't put them on myself and then I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm going to fucking sit down here for hours and hours and hours until I can get it on right. And then if I can master it, yay. And then I mastered it and I was like, yes. So your girl has been buying these shit in the past like week or two. Well, I started wearing these like kind of like the second or third week in June and look at this I have well some of them are gone because I ripped two pairs which were my favorite lashes right here which are from the company kiss by the way and they're the number 11s but I haven't tried any of their other kinds yet and then my brother bought me got me these from the wish app which is an amazing app by the way if you go on there i'm not being sponsored but just definitely download that shit because you can find some amazing clothes and random shit on there and then of course bought me some ardell ones which why there's only one is because i was cleaning them one night and i broke one in half yeah i need to be extra careful but you know they're pretty cheap Lashes usually run pretty cheap if you go to the drugstore, so, yeah. And then lastly, I guess I will talk about the scent of the season because why not? We always have a scent of the month and this is the scent of the season. And that is the Aloha Waterfall Orchid from Bath and Body Works. This shit I literally love. Like I will like spray my whole entire body with this shit. It's not, an, it's like, it's like that shimmer shit is. It's not very overpowering to me. Nobody's ever said that I'm wearing too much perfume. Like if I was wearing like my, my more expensive perfumes and if I get too much of it on, cause I'm like one of those types of people that literally want to bathe in it. So yeah. And of course I have to go grab the lotion that matches and the body wash that matches so that I can have it seep into my skin and make my skin smell divine basically divine amazing whatever whatever so so yeah so that is everything for my summer favorites um if you like this video give it a thumbs up i'm going to try to do a miscellaneous one like fashion and miscellaneous favorite ones if you're into that sort of thing so give it a thumbs up and i will definitely do one for you so i will see you next time and like i said at the beginning of the, vi the video don't forget to subscribe so you can be notified about amazing videos that i actually put up on here and also don't forget to follow me on my daily life on my social medias and what am I thinking? Oh, and don't forget to like this. And then if you have any products that you recommend and that you wish for me to try, you can comment down, down below or you can just, yeah, do that. And if you have any other great video ideas for me, just don't forget to comment down there and say, you should do this. You should do that because I listen to you. I don't ignore you like some YouTubers do. I'm not saying all, but some. But I will see you next time and obviously stay amazing.